So let's go ahead and jump right into public comment for folks that have signed up to comment today. And remember, folks that are here for public hearing um, on any of the other three agenda items will come later. Um, uh, Sam Bellamio and Alex Zimmerman. You each have two minutes. Thank you. Uh, my name is Sam Bellamy. I'm with Stand Up America. We are an organization that advocates for the less protected class, the poor, disabled, senior citizen, and students, uh, and any other class out there that doesn't have accurate representation through the government, um, which if you're not an organization or contributing $100,000 to a campaign, you're not being protected by the government. And that's why I'm here to talk today, is that the conversation is being controlled strictly by your committee. I know I'm coming and speaking to you openly because you're give, you give the sheet for doing that, but your rules don't require it, and that's my biggest pet peeve. And, and if you're going to say, your rules actually say I'm not allowed to speak unless it's to an agenda item. So it's because you're allowing me that I can speak that I'm speaking. So I want you to change the rules. I want you guys to start reacting. And this directly uh, relates to your committee because your committee doesn't require it. I'm glad that we get the chance. It's kind of like when you watch a presidential debate and they start talking about what's your favorite cereal. No one cares about that, but hey, the moderator's controlling the conversation, just like you're bringing up topics that when they become hot issues, people come out and talk about it, but you never invite them to talk about the small ideas that they could have to fix the, uh, the pollution we have in Seattle or uh, you know, the coal issue came up, and everyone came and talked about that. Now they're not here now because they know that you could just shut the mic off on me at any moment and not allow me to speak. And why, why would they come then? Because it's like talking to a wall. I've said this before. We can speak to a wall and get the same response we get from you. No action. No reaction. You don't care. And that's, that just proves that our government is failing here locally. You guys don't... Is it, I'm up? Two minutes? Up. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you for doing your job so effectively in destroying America. You're welcome. Hi. My name is Alex Zimmerman, and I represent Stand Up America. We advocate for poor people, disabled people, and senior citizens and students. For everybody who have trouble right now, and I think we're talking about something probably 100 million, 150 million people in the United States plus, and this plus go every year. So situation what we have right now, we're talking about government who's stealing from us a dozen and dozen million dollars per year. We're talking about human service department, and we spoke with you about this minimum for five years, who's stealing from us a dozen million dollars per year. We're talking about King Country Housing Authority and Seattle Housing Authority, who's stealing from us another dozen million dollars per year. We're talking about judicial system that has collapsed to the bones right now. We have a dozen judges who never report to, pe to people. We have a King Country prosecutor who never report to people. It's all elected official. We never hear these people. We cannot hear these people. This is very important. We're talking about uh, mayor of Seattle. We go to the, his mm, city hall meeting every time what is possible and try talking he, uh, about problem what is we have, about total conspiracy and corruption what is government have right now against poor people. He block us every time what is possible. It's a very absurd of situation, you know what this means? Your tyranny come right now to situation, so you're acting like a gangster with Gestapo principle. But it's not a simple point, because when you're acting like a gangster, this comes to situation what is you have stealing and racketeering money, and this is exactly from poor people. For example, emer energy assistance for poor people right now is gone for first two, three months before more and more money comes from federal government, from your government, state government, or local government. Right now, we uh, don't have this. And uh, you, for example, city up, mayor, Alex. and you, yeah, thank you very much, have approximately 20 million dollars. So we uh, ask you cut your thank salary you. by 10 million. Thank you very much. Bye. Uh, this is the end of the sign-up list. Is there anyone else in the audience that would like to provide public comment on today's agenda? All right. Thank